Hi. So I wanted to share this exciting new update with all of you with the plus add-ons for Elementor. And as you can see in this particular update, the onboarding or the setup has been revamped where we are asking you, how would you like to build a website? So if you know how to use the widgets, you can go with the, this one where you can pick up the login or whichever blog, widget you wish to use. Or if you are someone who wants to create a website and get it ready in under 60 seconds where you just want to replace the content, that is also in way. And in this way, we are also importing all the header and footer in the theme builder. So that is all well connected. So you will be getting a complete ready website, both with Elementor free and Elementor pro, because you will be also, will be also adding the theme builder feature. So I'll just quickly show you first the Elementor widgets. Okay. So here you are getting all the options to uh, enable the blocks. So you're having all the lists, like which one you want to use. We highly encourage to enable only those widgets, which you want to use on your website. Okay, so that it's lighter and you don't face any other issues. So for example, if you want to use just the blocks, you can use that or else you can completely disable or enable using this toggle. We have other widgets as well. And we have also given you a list of other features or the plugins, which the plus add-ons for Elementor replaces for you. So you will, once you click on this, you will be seeing all the demos uh, to enable this. Uh, so these are all the changes which uh, is available in the plus add-ons for Elementor. All right, let's move ahead. So this is the first way where you select the widgets or you can start with this one where everything will be set up. You don't have to do anything. I'll just click continue. Uh, this will be installing W design kit. This is just a medium to import the template. If in future you don't require any further templates, you can safely uninstall this, but it's hundred percent over to you. Uh, we just wanted to make sure the experience of importing the templates is super easy for you. All right. So once it is done, you will be redirected to this particular dashboard where you will be seeing multiple templates, uh, uh, which you can easily import. So it, it has multiple pages, like it has category 404. We have added all the pages. So all the kits are completed, uh, which use Elementor Pro widgets if you want, or the plus add-ons for Elementor, or even the plus add-ons for Elementor Pro widgets. Okay. So for example, uh, I wish to use this particular, uh, fitness related website. Okay. So we are also giving you a lot of customization as well as from here, you will be able to select which particular page you want to see. So for example, if you want to see the service page, you can check from here. All of them are interactive and you can, uh, before you import, you can check the live preview. So for example, let me add a name, witness website or your brand name, uh, make it easy, some tagline, whatever. If this is your WordPress default site name and the tagline. Okay. Then I'll click on next. Now here. Uh, we are giving you an option that what are the dependency you require. So for example, we are very soon, we will be adding more and more e-commerce templates. So completely full fetch e-commerce. In that case, we will be enabling the e-commerce or the WooCommerce one. If it's a dynamic website, so we are also planning to add ahead dynamic e-commerce, uh, sorry, the membership related websites. So in that case, we are going to install all the dependencies. Here again, we give you some suggestions of performance and security, which is completely optional. If you are already having some hosting or cache plugin set up on your end, it's fine. Or else we have selected some uh, plugins which work super well with the plus around experimented and good some phenomenally well, even with security and performance. So we suggest you to check this one out uh, in extras. If the templates like for it's a hundred percent optional, uh, we are not forced installing any plugins. The only the design, which is the plus add-ons for Elementor in most cases, which will be already be installed, that is installed. But if you feel that uh, any extra features you require, you can toggle this on and it will install the dependency. Again, for theme, you can use any Elementor optimized theme, but uh, next to theme, which is one of our own theme, is a bare minimum theme, which uh, which does not load any uh, CSS like on, and there's no major styling. So it's a bare, bare skeleton. Uh, theme. So we highly recommend that you can go ahead with this if you don't have any certain preference, but we can guarantee you that the next theme is simply a jQuery free super light one. Again, uh, important reminder, if this is your pre-made website with a lot of content, we highly suggest you to make a backup. If this is a fresh website, then you can just proceed to checkbox and proceed to the next one. But I again remind you, if this is a, your live production website with multiple content, then we highly recommend you to take a backup before you import this. Okay. So again, now you're seeing a next option, which is here that you can add demo content, which is all the demo content, which you saw in the demo preview, everything will be imported as it is very soon. We are working on the AI version, which will like, we will be asking you some questions related to your business or the website. And based on that, we are going to suggest you some images, uh, text, and we are also planning for global type, uh, like you suggesting you colors and typography. So you are going to see a uh, very soon AI improvised templates where the content will be generated as per your need. Okay. And not the dumb, dummy content. So for now, when you import the dummy content, you have to uh, replace the media. That's it. Other than that, all the stylings and everything are connected. And so 
this is the whole process. This will install anything required to make sure, like for example, the next extension, it's a free theme builder for Elementor and the theme. And this, since the plus add-ons for Elementor is already added, it won't be installed. And the global plugin and all the settings which are required to make sure the site works smoothly. So we'll be waiting for that. All right, so I'm almost done. Uh, so this can take time as per the amount of content or the media is there on the site. But in most cases, it should be done very quickly. So this is the about us page list. So as you can see, the home page, service page, all the blogs, single category, all the dynamic pages. Even since this was a fitness website, so we have added a BMI calculator page, pricing page, 404 page and coming soon pages as well. So we have gone far to give you a highly uh, customizable, all complete kit ready. Okay, so this is just the about us page is left. And then once that is done, the whole site is imported and we are ready to go. So as you can see, uh, the site has been imported and let's preview this. All right. So yeah, as you saw in the demo, everything is exact imported on my website with the teams and they are not going to be, you know, like as you see in the most of the kits, it's a very bland, simple images left, right. But we have gone for giving you all the customizations, which, uh, the, you see in, um, you know, website are uh, very dynamic and it's all customizable with the pricing page or the plan, whatever you like. And all of them, like since you use Elementor and all of them is 100% writable with Elementor, you can go ahead in the back end, replace the text as simply. So you, we are making sure that the whole import process becomes super easy for you. Okay. So let's go see, as you can see the home page, and you can start here and replace the content. Hello, this is my text. So yes, highly customizable. You have all the settings from your and each and every images can be replaced and it's all editable. So this was the one of the key feature which I wanted to share. Apart from that, uh, we have added like, I just wanted to share the small update related to tables. Okay. So in the tables one, we have added the SQL query. Okay. So free and just, you just have to add the SQL commands. For example, in this particular post, uh, since I've not added any SQL query, but uh, like data, so I'll just quickly, like, for example, I want to list my posts. Okay. So whatever posts I have, I wish to list on those. So I just simply add a SQL query and based on that, all my SQL table will be rendered here. So this is the next update, which you have added in this particular update. And there's a lot of presets, more kits. So as you know, like we have made sure that it's become super easy for you to start. So we have added all the kits. If you wish to import anything as such, you can simply click on this import button and you can add it on your website. Above all, just one last update, which there are multiple fixes, but just wanted to show you this another. So I guess, uh, you all know that we have added the plus addons comes with its own form builder. I'll just make sure this goes on the top. Okay. So we have also added the phone number. So in most, like even in the default element form, there's no phone number query. So in that case, in the phone number, we have added the way you can add the drop down for the phone number and we have given you two methods. Either you can select a default country, like for example, if you have clients from UK, you can select as per that or else uh, based on the user IP. So for example, if it's a business, which is from multiple, your traffic is coming from multiple traffic and you don't want to restrict to a particular location, then it will detect from the IP, whichever country the user is visiting. And as per that, it will show you the, uh, it will prefill it everything. So this is the minor new changes we have had. So make sure to check out the form widget from the plus announce for Elementor. And yeah, this was the new update and excited to present the upcoming new widgets coming up in this month, as well as the AI template import, which is going to be an exciting one for all of you. Thank you so much.